I'm Lauren Pastrana. And I'm Elliot Rodriguez with your election night update. Before we get you started, I want you to know we have results running at the bottom of your screen. We want to bring you up to date on the race for president in Florida. CBS 4's Jim DeFitti joins us now. And Jim, the early numbers are out in Miami-Dade, Broward County because of the amount of people voting early. What are the numbers telling you so far? Uh, the numbers are telling me that Donald Trump is doing far better than many people thought he was going to do in Miami-Dade County. Now, again, it's relative. He's losing Miami-Dade County, but he's losing it, you know, only by nine points. That's statewide totals. Those are the statewide totals that we're seeing right now with Joe Biden ahead by a couple of points. You know, we're still we're still waiting. I mean, again, that's about that's about uh, oh, a little over six million votes cast. Now, in Miami-Dade, as you can see, you know, again, Donald Trump is only down nine points in Miami-Dade. The goal for Donald Trump is not to try to win Miami-Dade County. It's not lose it as bad. Hillary Clinton won Miami-Dade County by 30 points. Uh, Barack Obama won it by 25 points. If those numbers hold up and Joe Biden is only going to win Miami-Dade County by nine or 10 points, uh, that's, a, that's going to be a real problem for him trying to make that up in other parts of the state. Not saying that that's not possible, but you know that's, that's, uh, that's not the type of numbers they were hoping to get out of Dade. Now in Broward, the numbers are much better. You know, you're seeing right there a 34-point advantage for for Joe Biden. So maybe between Dade and Broward you can make those two things up. You know, Broward can compensate for the for the poor numbers of Dade if you're in the Biden folks uh, Biden campaign. But uh, Donald Trump folks, they've got to be feeling feeling good about those numbers out of Miami-Dade, that's for sure. All right, Jim, and we'll be checking back again throughout the evening on the fight for Florida.